Do not try this at home. If you have alligators at home, I mean, you know. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, work on some name training and feeding with a specific alligator. I've worked with her since 2012. Her name is Saw, and she suffers from something called metabolic bone disease. So it's a nutritional deficiency that resulted in stunted growth. Her teeth go out instead of down, hence her name Saw. Her face kinda looks like a saw blade. Her skull structure is warped because of this and her jaw only opens up like this much. So that's why I actually have to hand feed her with tongs because she can't pick up the meat on her own. And so you have to actually put it into her mouth because she can't get it on her own. Now, she does open it up just enough to fit a finger though. So you also have to be a little bit careful. Saw. 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 Good girl. So she stops and she waits. So. That's as wide as she gets. So. That's a leap. Come here. I'm gonna have to kick that one out. Look, they're all getting excited. Come on. So, oh, she'll bite you. That's what I was telling you, there's no bond. There's no bond, there's no love. Casper, same thing, you're feeding him, you can raise him from the time he hatched out of the egg. If you make a mistake feeding him, he will kill you, he will eat you. There will be no remorse, there's no love lost. That's super important to understand, that's what I was trying to say in the beginning, like they do not love you, they don't like you. <laughs> so. Yeah, she'll bite you. But that's why like the training is really important because being able to call her over and separate her from the other ones for one, although when they see there's food, they all get crazy as you can tell. But then the training also helps because she knows that when I hold on to her, like that's normal, that's part of it. She doesn't usually try to go for my hand at that point and it gets her to sit. No, don't run, come here. Come here, don't run from me. Come here, you're okay. Come on, be good. Uh, super important, don't forget, we're gonna step over here, we're not gonna go near her nest. If you wanna see why, if I walk over, do you mind if I, can I, can I have these? So she's gonna come over and defend the nest and try to kill you. Yeah, so that's her. I've trained her, that's what I'm saying. Like I have that thing better trained than most people's dogs. 